Right, okay, yo, I'm gonna show you this, my technique. First thing you do is you get yourself your a little container, doesn't matter what it is, you can use a bucket. I use these long tongs here, and what I'm gonna do is I'll set this uh, container on the floor. I don't need to put any water in it, so let's do that now. Now what I will do is I will reach into this tank with my tongs, grab this java moss here, just unceremoniously grab it quickly, put it down into the container. Okay, and now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna put the uh, java moss into this tank. Hopefully you can get this on frame just right. Give it a little shake. See, there's lots and lots of scuds. I'll just drop this in there. And I also have, see if I can get this in here so we can see it. Uh, lots of scuds in this thing still, so I just take a little bit of water from the tank, give it a good swishing around a little bit, and just like that we get them all out. Actually I have a little more, I'll just drip a little water in from this net. Really a nice food for these uh, pistos, so I'm hoping this is all getting in frame here real well. Get closer. There was quite a few. They immediately hide. I'll just watch on the playback and see, but uh, the mollies over here and uh, the pistos in the hut, they'll, they will pick on those, pick those off over the next few days. So I hope that was, uh, I'll check it out and hopefully it turned out okay. Anyway, thanks a lot everybody, have a great day, bye-bye. Oh, I'd also like to add this very important uh, to replace the uh, java moss that you just put in. Um, so I'm gonna grab another little chunk here that's, give it a little bit of a shake as well. It doesn't have to be a lot. Just a piece, uh, let's see if I can get this. Uh, it's kind of hard to do this with one hand here. There we go. Into this tank. Ah. Sometimes it just doesn't work the way you want it to. There it goes, it's gonna float down. Floating down. And uh, once it's in there, all those scuds that were on there was just a, a very, very small amount. I know you can't see a whole lot here, but there are literally hundreds of those scuds. They hide everywhere. They hide, if you look closely, you can see them. They sit on top of the snail shells. They're all over the substrate. They're a little uh, freaked out right now because I just did that, but I just fed this tank some repashy and I got a jam pile of snails there. <laughs> so, anyhow, I hope you enjoyed that and um, maybe I'll try and redo this video sometime and make it a little more refined. Thanks everybody. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.